All right, welcome to Provo, Utah once again for the second game of a three-game series between the Wenatchee Wolves and the West Coast Renegades. We're here in Olympic Stadium from Salt Lake 2002 where Olympic hockey was played. This is the third Olympic hockey stadium I've seen my son play in, including this one in Vancouver and Calgary. As Markham comes out to take the face off for the Wenatchee Wolves. He's got Flynn and Childers on his wings and Foss and Fritz on the back end. This is a great stadium to film in and if we have any problems with the video, it's going to be my fault and not, not the stadium location as Wenatchee takes the face off to start this game. Goes back to Fritz. Fritz trying to get it to Markham. Can't quite make the connection. Taken by West Coast. And shot to it into Bobby. He's going to deflect it off to the left side. Wenatchee behind the net. Trying to get it out. Can't quite make the connection. Stepping in front is Fritz. He's able to get the puck over to the corner. Childers puts it back in behind the net. Picked up by Fritz. Fritz is trying to send it out. Can't get to Childers. And a good hit by Childers. Separates the puck. And Flynn puts it down on to the other end. Flynn's going to give chase, goes all the way to the goal, and it's pushed off to the left side. Back into the left corner, out with it. Comes Wenatchee, Measles going to take the shot, puts it in, deflected again, off to the left, coming up is Markham. Into the corner, again Measle with the shot in, comes off of Flynn's skate and goes over to the right side. In there is Lindbergh, Lindbergh steps up, puts it over into the corner again. Measle. Over to his defensive partner. Shot taken right into the glove of the West Coast goalie and we'll get a stoppage. 15.52 left in the first period of this contest between the West Coast Renegades and the Wenatchee Wolves. Williams will come in to do the face-off duties for the Wolves. As the puck comes back into the defense and the neutral zone. Picked up there by Fritz. Tipped by West Coast on a good play back into the left-hand corner. Shot comes in. Good block by Bovey as he puts the leg pad down and says, not today. Goes back all the way down to the other end, giving chase is Wenatchee. I think that's Alonzo as he takes a big hit, stays on the puck. Back in the corner, Wenatchee's going to come away with it. Beliveau sends it behind the net, comes back over to the right side, stepping up. Was Fritzy, but he decides to retreat. Now through the neutral zone goes West Coast. They dump it into the left side. Shot deflected by the defense out in front. Picked up in the blue line and a good play there by Alonzo as he takes the puck, comes in, looks. Good move as he steps up to the goal and puts one on the post and then it bounces out. And when West Coast is able to cover, it draws the whistle. Last night had a lot of physicality here in front of the net. Several fights that happened. One player ejected, lots of penalties, and it looks like a little bit less rough of a game to start so far, but again, contact in front of the net as we go to the right circle for a face-off. Coming in is Rivers' ball as he steps up. Puck comes out. And taken by Wenatchee. Measle with it. Drops one in over the net. As West Coast goes in for the breakout. Wenatchee takes it through the neutral zone. Measle looking for Kathy. Can't quite get there. And it goes in behind the West Coast net. Ball puts it up, but lifts it into the netting. And we should have a neutral zone faceoff after that whistle. Ball comes in for the face-off duty. Puck comes back to Wenatchee. D to D pass. Foss can't get control, but he's going to run back and get it. Goes for the dump. Still in the neutral zone. Battle there. Goes towards the Wenatchee end. Giving chase is Foss, but Bovey's going to get there first. He sends it off to the left side. Let's go. going to pick it up. Deflected out in front by Measle. And picked up by Kathy. Kathy skates it into the West Coast end. And over the left corner. Trying to push it through. Takes a little contact, but the puck goes behind the net of West Coast. Right side, Hennessy there. Trying to get it back. Can't get it to his D, and West Coast will take over. Drops down 
towards the towards Bovey and then sent right back down by Wenatchee on what will be icing with 1347 left in the first period. Face off goes towards the Wenatchee end. Alonzo is giving chase, picks it up, turns around, puts it off the board, gets it in the neutral zone. The icing's waved off. Yeah, Shuckman comes in to put on the four check. Wenatchee keeps it in there in. Good pass from the D, and the shot's taken in. He's right into the breadbasket of the West Coast goalie. And I don't believe that's the same one as we had yesterday. Uh, I called him Hoyer all game long, but his, I talked to him before the game today and his last name is Poyer, and I apologize for that if you're from West Coast and you were yelling at me on the yesterday's video. But Poyer had a great game as Wenatchee goes in for the faceoff, comes out towards them, but it's gonna be taken by West Coast. West Coast retreats into their end. Takes a look, sends it off the board, right in the neutral zone, there to pick it up is Lindbergh. Lindbergh gets it into the West Coast end and they'll retreat one more time. Now West Coast moving through the mid ice, picked up by Wenatchee. Shuckman sends it towards Forsberg. Forsberg dumps it into the zone, up there to pick it up Shuckman, now taken by West Coast. West Coast through the neutral zone, that's Redding, comes back to Fritz, Fritz is gonna Put it off the glass, trying to find his outlet, gets it to the neutral zone. West Coast picks it up there, goes into their own zone now, retreating, D to D pass. Goes off the board, pressure by Childers as he comes in on the forecheck. Good play by Childers as he has disrupted them and creates a Shuckman opportunity and a great glove save by the West Coast goalie on the Shuckman shot. Created by the pressure on the forecheck by Childers. Neutral zone faceoff for, or excuse me, West Coast in faceoff for Wenatchee. Here's Markham steps in to do the duties. Faceoff goes back in behind the net of West Coast. Flynn's there on the pressure. Sent down in through the neutral zone. Sorry, I missed the puck. It was up against the board. Well, I got a good shot of Hunter Hodson taking a shot in the back as Measles skates forward through mid ice. Going to put it into the West Coast in. Shot taken up off the glove. And Flynn coming in, trying to make the best of a loose puck. Takes a shot on a, into the goal. But before that was Measel with a nice little shot from the top of the circle that was turned away by a West Coast goalie. Face off goes to Wenatchee, turned over to West Coast. They're gonna skate through mid ice, two on one developing. Shot taken high and over the, over the net, comes back over towards the right board. Now put into the neutral zone again. Retreating is West Coast, comes into their end. Good backhanded pass, goes to number 88. Shot goes off a of measles knee pad. He chases it back into the corner. Picked up by Markham. Markham sends it to Flynn. Flynn's gonna skate up. Gets it over towards Alonso. Alonso's gonna scoot over and make the shot. And it's in, and it's called. Good Joe by Alonso as he skates over from the left and makes a move right in front of the goalie to put a backhanded shot in. And that's the first goal of the game with 11.35. Score that one. I believe it was Flynn to Alonzo as Alonzo skates it up through the neutral zone and into the West Coast end. Discussion by the referees here.
And this goal will stand. So score the first goal for Alonzo, making it a one to nothing game at 11.35 of the first period. Face off goes back to Foss. Foss is gonna move through the neutral zone, sends it into the, in, into the West Coast end. Beliveau with a little backhand, puts it into the corner. Williams picks it up, sends it in front of the net. Alonzo then Gare again one more time. And that has got to be a penalty. And it is. And number 10 for West Coast is going to go to the box. I believe it's for the roughing as he pulled Alonzo down with the horse collar right in front of the net and he's going to spend two minutes in the box. Williams comes in to take the face off, goes back into the defense at the blue line, sent back towards the top of the circle, skating down. Shot taken up in front, pucks on the ice, out with it comes West Coast and then Wenatchee steps in. That was Foss, I believe, as he took a shot in. West Coast now with it, trying to get it out. They do. Bovey stops it. He's going to send a long pass over to Williams. Williams is going to have it in the neutral zone, looking for his outlet, finds Alonzo. Alonzo gives it up to number 32 for West Coast, and they send it back in behind the net one more time. 124 left in the penalty as Foss skates up into the neutral zone. Given to Alonzo. As he turns around, setting it up on out in front and kicked towards the goal, turned away by the West Coast goalie and into the left side. Foss at the blue line, sends it to his D partner, comes into the middle towards Belvo, and Belvo takes a hit for it. Now into the top of the circle, shot taken just over the net and back into the neutral zone. Chasing it down is Lindbergh as Lindbergh skates through the neutral zone, next pass a bit nice, takes it into the West Coast end, shoots in behind the net, deflected by the West Coast goalie and goes into the right side. Bounces past Measle, West Coast with an opportunity, shorthanded, and a good play by Markham, stops that move. Behind the net. Yes. As the whistle is called, I believe they, they called it a cover for Bovey as we're going to have a left circle face off. I think he'd let it go as he just stopped the move coming in from the left side of the net. But we'll have a face off anyway. 38 seconds left in the power play. One to nothing is the score with 9.59 left in the first period. Comes out to, to Measle. Measle's going to skate towards the mid ice. Pass goes behind Flynn. Flynn's going to turn around with it and gets back. As Childers was just a little offside, I thought he made it, but it was close and we'll give the referee the benefit of, or the lineman the benefit of the doubt. Markham's gonna take a step up. He's gonna have the face off. Neutral zone on the left side. Comes out, goes back to Lindbergh. Lindbergh takes it, sends it in deep. Wenatchee's on the chase, Childers is there. Kept in, oh, just past Measle as he can't get his stick on it. But he goes back on a good back check and gets the puck. Goes to Flynn. Flynn dumps it in towards Markham. Picked up by Childers. Childers makes a move. And has it taken by West Coast and goes back to the blue line. Lindbergh there and deflected shot. Goes all the way back to the Wenatchee end. We're at five on five hockey. Flynn's there. And now Measle. Measle looks up, finds uh, Hennessy, Hennessy comes in, thought it was Alonzo for a second, as Hennessy dumps it in behind the net of West Coast, then goes on the forecheck. Finishes off the hit in behind the net as West Coast skates past mid ice. Back in and shot behind the net. Pass comes out from Ball, he finds Kathy. Kathy's gonna skate it into the West Coast end, takes a shot and a good stop by West Coast, draws a whistle with 8.45 left in the first period. According to the scoreboard, we've got eight shots on net for Wenatchee, two for West Coast. And that seems pretty accurate to me so far in this game. Ball in for the faceoff. 
Going to be picked up by West Coast. Skates over towards the left side, gets it in the neutral zone. Hodson with it, sends it to his partner, Fritz. Fritz is going to retreat just a little bit. Back to Hodson. Hodson, good pass by Hodson as he puts it on the blue line. Kathy trying to get it in, can't quite do it. As West Coast tries to make an opportunity from the blue line, Hodson puts a skate on it and turns it away. Skating forward is Wenatchee. Pass goes in behind Kathy. Kathy's going to skate past mid ice and move it into the West Coast end. Goes a good pass over to the right. Can't quite make the connection though. His ball is going to send it back towards his defense and stepping up is Foss and he's able to get there. Behind the net is West Coast. Wenatchee with the pressure and they're going to come out with it. Ball has the puck. He's looking and he gets knocked down from behind and pushed on into the board. West Coast skating towards the Wenatchee in and has a tuck taken away by Hodston and Foss is going to take it behind the Wenatchee net. A lot of contact away from the play there on Foss as the puck goes through into the West Coast end and Wenatchee was off sides and has to turn around. Shot deflected by Bovey to the right side into the corner. When actually gets there, Lindbergh's on the play. She comes out towards Forsberg. And the battle takes it, is just kept in by West Coast. And now it's into the neutral zone. Forsberg on the four check as the pass goes into the Wenatchee in. Now Flynn with the puck. Skates it himself on the right side. All the way in. And, to, and it deflected to the left end. Measles there. Excuse me, make that Shuckman. As it goes to the right side, Fritz keeping it into the right corner where Flynn, I believe, no, make that Forsberg is in a battle. And out with it comes Wenatchee in the neutral zone. From mid ice, West Coast sends it behind the net. Measles going to pick it up, sends it to Alonzo. Alonzo trying to find Balavo and sends a pass behind him where West Coast is going to pick it up. West Coast through the middle, touched by a player and then giving chase is Measles and Fritz. Backhand goes behind the net. And Fritz sends it towards Balavo, comes out in front. Good pass there by Alonzo towards Fritz, I believe as it goes over to the left side. Good contact there by Alonzo as he slows the movement of the play. Wenatchee's going to get it as Hodson tries to send it to the blue line, gets through two players and goes all the way through for the icing. 536 left in the first period, scores one to nothing in favor of the Wolves. Right circle face off, Wenatchee end for Markham. As the referee drops the puck, but it wasn't on purpose, so we'll do it again as shot is taken by West Coast and picked up by Wenatchee. Childers with the puck, gets it off the board, and good play there by West Coast to take it right in front of Childers as he had a head of steam going the other way. Shot taken and it goes in. So left circle shot by West Coast gets by Bobby at 520 of the first period. And we now have a one-to-one -one game between the West Coast Renegades and the Wenatchee Wolves. After the goal, faceoff goes back to Measle. Measle sends it in deep. And we'll have icing on West Coast at 5.05 left of the first period.
Face off goes back to Wenatchee, gives it to Lindbergh. Lindbergh with the shot up, goes into the glove of the West Coast goalie, and we'll do another face off. Five minutes left in the first period. Good play there by Measles. He keeps it in, still has the puck, steps up, goes around a man, still battling, and gets it back in deep. There to get it's going to be Hennessy as he tries to get back before West Coast goalie can put a glove on it, but he's just a little bit short, and we'll have another whistle. 4.43 left in the first period of this one-to-one -one contest. Faceoff goes back to Wenatchee. Foss now has it at the blue line. Takes a shot deflected by the goalie as it goes into the left corner. Hennessy gets it down low to Ball. Ball trying to get through, gets it back to Hennessy, and the shot's going to be taken by Kathy, and it's stopped. And a shot taken at the blue line by Mueller is going to be grabbed by the West Coast goalie and we'll have a face off on the right circle. Puck back into the right corner, goes back to, to me Fritz. And back into the Wenatchee in. No icing on the play. And Fritz is going to send it back towards the middle. Gets it to West Coast. Oh, a good play there by Markham to turn the puck around and go the other direction. Pass back to Forsberg. Now it's at the top of the circle. It's a good pass over to Foss. Foss is going to make a move. Wide right is the play. Back to the blue line. Kept in there by Fritz. He takes a look. Skates it up. Goes back over to Foss. Foss with the shot deflected. Oh, just off the right post and over into the right corner. Another shot sent in behind the net. There to get it is Markham. Markham steps towards the back of the net, sends it over in behind Old Forsberg, and now back out to the defense. Over to the left side, Foss can't control it, but it's going to come right back to him. He sends one in deep behind the net. West Coast is going to be there to pick it up. Oh, and a deflected shot bounces right in front of the goalie. Almost goes in. He makes a good play to stop it. Now we're on the left board in the neutral zone as West Coast sends it all the way down. Can I get you a chair? I've got one right here. Do you want this one? Or I can, here, uh, this one's probably better. Thank you. You're welcome. That's kind of a, it's a softer chair, but it's not very good. I'm not using any of them, so you guys can have all these chairs you want, really. You can have this one right here. Oh yeah, you can have that. You're welcome. And the faceoff goes back to Hodson. Hodson sends it to Measle. Now lifted into the West Coast end. 242 left in the first period as West Coast takes it behind their own net. Out to blue line, kept in, now Pushed into the neutral zone and out of play. And we'll have a neutral zone faceoff. Take that back. No one touched it. I thought there was some contact. So we'll go into the West Coast end for this faceoff with 2.33 left in the first period. One to one is the score between the Renegades and the Wolves. Williams there. Faceoff goes back to the Wenatchee D. Now onto the right hand side. Out in front on a good pass. Moves forward, deflected to the left side. 
Hodson with the shot, deflected over to the right, and back in the D as Measle goes for the body, and we're gonna have a whistle. High stick will be the call. And, oh, a slashing's the call. I thought he called high stick, but it's a slash. 2.14 left in the first, and Wenatchee will be on the power play with that penalty. Flynn, Childers, and Markham come out on the power play. They'll have Foss. And Fritz on the defensive line. Puck is lifted in, out of play, off the faceoff. As a reminder, always pay attention to the ice as pucks could come flying off at any time. Markham's second faceoff goes to Foss. Foss turns around, looks, gets it over to Fritz. Fritz takes a look and puts it right back to Foss. When Achi starts to develop their move into the West Coast end, Foss is going to carry it himself. Sends it in behind the net, where it's going to be picked up by Markham. Markham can't quite control it, but it's going to be held in by Fritz on the line. Fritz loses control, but Foss is able to take, take it back, and Fritz will step over to the circle. Fritz takes the move, puts it right in front, kept in by Markham. Markham gives it back to Fritz. Fritz down low to Childers. Childers steps up, takes a look. Front of the blue line, shot taken and controlled by the West Coast goalie. 115 left in the power play for Wenatchee, 128 left in the first period. Williams face off taken by West Coast into the neutral zone. Measle there on the defense and West Coast is gonna retreat. Now West Coast sends it down to Wenatchian, stopped at the blue line by Lindbergh. Lindbergh gives it to Alonzo. Alonzo out in front to Measle. Measle steps across the line. Measle in the circle, trying to find some help. Gets to Williams. Williams is gonna take it to the other circle. With a look, goes down to the low end, Belvo with the puck, gives it back to Williams. They're out in front to Lindbergh, Lindbergh with the shot, and it's knocked out in front of the net, but Lindbergh can keep it in, and he's able to get it back over to Measle. Measle steps up over across, good pass. Williams takes a step, bounces, deflected to the right, and over to the right board. West Coast sends it down the line, 20 seconds left in the power play, 32 seconds left in the period as Lindbergh's behind his own net, and he's gonna skate out. Long pass towards Williams. Williams carries it into the blue line. Good defense there by West Coast as Kathy steps up to get the puck. Out in front to Fritz. Fritz moves forward, takes a shot, blockered off and over the net, and into the right side. Whistle blown for the high stick. And we'll have a face off, I believe, in the neutral zone. Make that in the Wenatchee end with 11.2 seconds left in the first period. Face off comes out to Wenatchee, skating forward with it. It's Alonzo. He puts it off the board, finds Kathy. Kathy's chasing down the puck into the right end, turns around. Sends it forward, ball has a shot at it, and that's your first period. So at the end of one period, score is one to one between the West Coast Renegades and the Wenatchee Wolves. And we'll be back in one minute to start the second period.
And we're back for the start of the second period after the coaches have had their opportunity to talk to the players. And the faceoff's gonna go to Markham. Markham pushes it back towards the defense and it gets back to Fritz. Fritz steps in behind the net, makes a move. And a dangerous play as it goes out in front. Childers sending one forward, gets it to back to Fritz. Fritz is gonna skate it into the West Coast end. Fritz again with the puck on the left board. Comes out towards Markham. Now back in towards the Wenatchee end. In front of the blue line. Shot taken, deflected off to the right. Picked up by Foss. Foss puts it off the glass, held in by West Coast. And to the circle on a good pass and a good stop there by Bovey as Childers lifts it up and into the neutral zone. In behind the net goes West Coast. As the puck goes up and out of play. And we should have a West Coast end faceoff when we return. 16-03 left in the second period of this one-to-one -one game. Faceoff goes towards Wenatchee, now behind the net with West Coast in control. Right corner, back in behind the net again. Good floor check by Alonzo and the rest of the forward staff by West by Wenatchee as they're able to keep it in once more on a good play by Williams. Still in the zone, Belvo comes up and he puts it back in. Great floor check by Wenatchee as they disrupt West Coast and are able to keep it in their zone for one more series. Kept in there again by Lindbergh, but they're gonna call offsides. I don't know if I agree with that call, but we'll take it anyway. Williams face off, goes back to the Wenatchee end, sent in deep and behind the net. Lonzo on the forecheck, comes back over to the right side. Now comes over to Beliveau and in front. Lonzo with the puck, steps over to the circle, sends one into the corner. And it comes out to the left side. Whistle blown. Whistle on the play as referees pick up the puck. Cover by Bovey. And we'll go to Wenatchee's left circle for the faceoff. Ball in for the faceoff, comes straight back down. Shot taken by West Coast, he is covered by Bovey, and he'll draw this, another whistle. Go back over to the left circle, 14.54 left in the second period. Comes back to Wenatchee, Hodston with it. Puts it off the board, can't get it out of the zone. And out in front, good stop on a deflection by Bovey as it sends over to the right corner. Back to the blue line, kept in again by West Coast. As the puck goes over into the right end, Wenatchee in control, gets it the neutral zone. Giving Chase his ball, he's got an opportunity. So he comes into the zone, takes the shot deflected, and over the net, back to the right side. There to pick it up, Sposs. Now with Hennessy, Hennessy skating in behind the net, gives it up to Forsberg, I think it might have been Beliveau, and we're gonna be on to the blue line, taking on a two on one now possibility by West Coast, but Wenatchee's gonna defend it. Shot deflected off to the right, and a good play there by Hodson as he gets a stick on it and stops the second shot. Now right in front, out, oh, good pass, but not able to capitalize, and in the stop. by Bovey drawing the whistle and I'm not sure what it's for.
Face off goes back to West Coast. Dumped in, deflected in front of the net, over to the right side. Forsberg giving chase. And he's going to end up in the corner and sends it behind the net. Measles putting the sticks on it. West Coast comes out with it, sends it back towards their blue line. Now D to D. Shot taken from in front of the net. Out, oh, well, out in front to the left side. There was a little bit of an opening there, but West Coast couldn't come up with it. Now over to the right side. Shot off the stick of Bovey and sent to the left. Picked up by Alonzo. Alonzo skates through the middle. Pucks over on the right side. Forsberg sends towards Alonzo. Out with it comes West Coast. Good forecheck by Forsberg as Wenatchee is going to get back to the puck. Shuckman there with it, trying to send it in deep. And the pass goes in over to West Coast. Big hit there by Flynn as he steps up at the neutral zone. And it gets sent back into the West Coast end. Nice play by Flynn as puck goes into Wenatchee's end. Lindbergh on the defense, out in front, goes over to the right board. Skating up with it is Fritz, and he puts it off a man, gets it into the West Coast end. 24 for West Coast is going to carry it and has to turn around, send it back behind his net. Long pass, good pass by West Coast, gets it in the neutral zone. Shot behind the net. Puck sent off the board and into the West Coast bench for the whistle, 11.59, left in the first period. Excuse me, second period. Faceoff will be in the West Coast end. Puck goes down, sent over to left board, now back in behind. Foss sends it behind the net, looking for Hodson. Hodson puts it right back. Childers with it. He sends it out towards Flynn. Flynn's going to skate with it, puts it through the middle, and back in behind the net. Flynn now with it. As Puck goes out, into the neutral zone, carried by West Coast. And off the post, deflected initially by Bovey and then put off, and then it just touches the left post and goes into the left corner. Now battle in the corner, comes out to Foss, and Foss puts it out of, I thought it was out of play, but no, it's gonna go back into the other end and they wave off the icing. West Coast sends it right back towards Wenatchee. Into the neutral zone. And we'll have offsides on Wenatchee at 10.44 left to end the second period. Shots on goal have turned around as West Coast is now, according to the scoreboard, tied with Wenatchee, 4-12. Face off goes back into Wenatchee. They send it in deep. Lindbergh's gonna keep it in the zone. Little help by Williams, puts it behind the net. Beliveau comes in on the four check. Now it's on the right board. Fritz keeps it in the zone. Picked up by the West Coast goalie, now in the right, right corner. West Coast, no one, on, no one on the man as he skates it into the neutral zone. And then the Wenatchee defense picks it up. Good neutral zone pressure as Bovey comes back, settles the puck, gives it to Fritz. Fritz puts it right back. Battle in the left corner. 
Comes out to Wenatchee, that's Alonzo. Alonzo skating on the right board. Out in front, shot taken just off the blocker to the left side and now into the right behind, on into the boards. Big hit there by Alonzo. He's gonna get the penalty. So interference is the call on Alonzo. With 9.37 left in the first period or second period. Natchi on the penalty kill. There's Markham comes in on the faceoff. Measle there on the board, holding it in his feet. Out with it. Comes West Coast. Back in their own end. Foss turns it around towards the right board and Wenatchee picks it up, sends it down to the other end. 130 left in the penalty for Wenatchee. West Coast now in the Wenatchee end on the left side. Shots deflected, goes all the way over to the right. And West Coast loses it into the neutral zone. They have to retreat one more time. 105 left in the penalty as West Coast goes behind their own net. West Coast skating forward, gets it into the Wenatchee end. Hodgson's there to put it in the neutral zone. Oh, and the puck goes on a bad bounce right in front of the West Coast net. Lucky play for West Coast as Childers puts on the four check. They're able to get it out, skating forward. It is West Coast. Dropped over to the top of the circle, shot taken. And on the deflection, West Coast is able to put one in on the power play for the goal. Two to one is now the score with 7.56 left in the second period. Of this game. After the goal, ball on the faceoff, goes back into center, pushed off to the left side. Foss is gonna get there to pick it up. Mid ice, sent in deep, over to the right side. Out with it's going to come. West Coast, moving the other direction. And behind the net of West Coast goes the puck. On the right side, Fritz is there, deflected by West Coast in behind the net. As Wenatchee takes it back out, puts it on the blue line, shots wide right. Comes all the way back to the right side where it gets past Fritz and into the neutral zone. Foss on the defense, top of the circle, shots taken. Doc blockered off to the left by Bovey and sent in behind the net. Fritz has the puck. He's skating up with it. And it goes back in. Puck comes out. That'll be Kathy giving to Hennessy. Hennessy out in front in the slot. Backhanded by Hennessy and Markham as the puck goes all the way down the other end. Measles giving chase, puts it off the board into the neutral zone. Markham touches it, Childers trying to get to it, puck just goes by his feet. Oh, 
Oh, West Coast player can't get the stick on it. Trickles in towards Bovey, who covers it up, and then he takes a hard shot into the board. Not sure if he was tripped or just missed, but hard shot there. So there's a little bit of talk between Measel and him. Markham in for the faceoff. Pucks lifted by Childers, can't keep control. And it goes back into the, into the right corner. Deflected off towards Measel. Measel skates up, sends it up through the middle, finds Flynn. Flynn skates through the mid-ice. Got on a run, he's got Childers on the right as he goes in behind the net. Now on the Wenatchee in. Picked up by Markham. Markham skating forward through mid-ice and into the West Coast end. Shot deflected off the legs of a West Coast player and comes up the blue line. Kept in by Forsberg and then now into the neutral zone by West Coast. Pushed past mid-ice. Now into the Wenatchee end. Right out in the slot. Stopped there on a good play by Kathy, I believe. As Puck goes off the post again. No call on the play. They think it was in, but it looks like it popped straight out and I didn't see it very well of what it did before it popped out. So I won't make a comment on whether that was in or not. As West Coast comes into the neutral zone, now with into the Wenatchee and out into the slot. Good play by West Coast as it goes into the left side. Hodston sends it over to the left. Now West Coast sends it right back behind the Wenatchee net. Kathy on the right side, in the corner. Out with it comes Wenatchee. That's Shuckman. Shots deflected off of Fritz's foot, goes over to the right end. Held in by West Coast at the blue line. And now sent all the way down for what should be the icing, and it is. 4-0-1 left in the second period. 2-1 is the score. One goal deficit for the Wolves to the West Coast Renegades. They, there was a goal scored, but no time went off the clock and nothing happened. The door was open, people were coming through. I'm not sure what went on, but if it did, it's kind of Bush League. As they've called a goal, I didn't see it because the door was open as a player was leaving the ice to go to the locker room and they scored it. And now they put 50 seconds back on the clock. I'm not sure what's going on here, but everything is wrong as it had 401 on the clock and now there's 435 and I have no clue what is going on in West, in uh, Provo, Utah. And I don't think the referees do either. Puck's blocked into the neutral zone.
As puck moves over top of the circle over to the right side. I believe the call is going to be too many men on the ice for West Coast. And that should be the call as West Coast sends a man in the box with 344 left in the second period. Mark them in for the faceoff on the power play for Wenatchee. See if they can cut this deficit in half with 3.44 left in the second period. Flynn takes it, shot goes right off the blocker and to the left side, out in front. Another shot off the glove and above. Flynn's there, out in front, sends it to the, and covered. And that's going to send another player for West Coast into the box. Put Wenatchee on the five on three. And number nine for West Coast is going to go to the locker room. I think he's been ejected. There's a five minute penalty on the board for him for fighting. As we wait once again for the referees to sort things out. This happened several times last night. As I believe there's been an ejection of number nine for West Coast. So there's a five minute penalty on the board and he has gone to the locker room.
We're gonna take a pause until they sort this or they come out, so. And West Coast gonna send a second player into the box. So number nine's been ejected from the game for fighting. And we'll have a five on three for Wenatchee. Mark, I'm on the face off. Puck comes out to Foss. Foss is gonna step on the blue line. Comes out to the circle. Childers steps up, takes a look. Battle in the corner, comes back out to Measle. Measle sends it over to the top of the circle. Shot's taken, lifted up over the net. Childers settles it down, sends it back in behind, finds Markham. Markham sends it right back to Childers. Out in front, good pass. No one's there to take the shot. Now top of the circle, Measle deflected. Back, right back to him. He sends it over to Markham. Markham takes the shot, deflected over to the left side. Now Foss. Foss steps up, looks. Shot goes in. And that's Foss from the top of the circle. Excuse me, just inside the blue line as he cuts this deficit in half. Wenatchee will still be on the power play. As one of the penalties comes off the board and this will be a five on four. Three to two is now the score. 250 left in the second period. 418 left in the penalty for West Coast. Williams there on the faceoff. Lonzo and Beliveau on the wings. Measle and Foss on defense. Faceoff goes back to Wenatchee. Williams retreats back into his zone, gives it to Measle. Measle to Foss. Dropped up towards Beliveau. Beliveau gives it to Alonzo. Skated in by Foss. Over to the top of the circle goes Wenatchee. As they now skate forward, D to D. Measle with the shot, ah, oh, just wide left and it goes back over to the left side. Again to Measle, Measle just inside the blue line, skates up, gives it over to F uh, Williams off the post and out from the top of the circle. 3.43 left in the penalty, 2.15 left in the second period. Puck goes to West Coast, sends it all the way down the Wenatchee end. Bovey's gonna get, settle it. Sends it off the board, picked up by Williams. Williams goes to Alonzo, Alonzo skates it into the zone. Shot taken, wide right, and back to the left side. Williams dumps it towards Fritz. Fritz puts it back in deep, there to pick it up is Alonzo. Taken by West Coast, held up on the board, and pop out to Wenatchee. Williams gets back to Fritz. Fritz is gonna step up from the middle, deflected off West Coast, and sent back to the Wenatchee in. Bovey puts it over towards the right side, picked up by West Coast. Skates to the neutral zone, back to their defense. 255 left in the penalty, 127 left in the period. Alonso picks up the puck, steps to the top of the circle, bouncing puck, goes over a stick. He's gonna have to send it back to the defense. Top of the slot, off the leg pads of West Coast and now carried over to the top of the circle. Fritz with the puck. Skating on the left side, now Markham. Shots taken, deflected, and put to the left side of the net. West Coast can send it all the way down, under a minute to play in the second period. Three to two is the score. As Wenatchee's gonna try one more time to make, a, make something happen, as it's long past the Childers, he dumps it towards Markham. Markham comes up. Weasel over to the top of the circle, Foss. Shot taken, deflected on the left side. Markham's trying to get to it. Puts it behind the net, or towards the back of the net. Flynn's there. As Childers comes up, sends it out in front. And 
just trickles into the neutral zone. We'll naturally have to reset with 12 seconds left. Measle now with the puck, mid ice. Top of the circle, shots deflected, picked up by Foss. Backhanded shot, goes over to the left side, two seconds. And behind the net, and that'll be the end of the second period. So, with two periods complete, score is now three to two in favor of the West Coast Renegades as we'll take a break, I believe, for the Zamboni to come out and maintain the ice when Wenatchee comes back to start the third period. They'll have a power play for 127. And an opportunity to stop this, or to reduce, or tie up this game three to three. We'll come back at the start of the third period. And I guess if I actually want to do play-by-play, -play, I've got to turn the microphones on as Wenatchee starts out the third period on the power play. And shot by Flynn is deflected over to the left, right and into the netting. And Wenatchee will have one more short opportunity to tie this up on the power play with 44 seconds left. Three to two is the score. Wenatchee down by a goal, 16-16 left in the third period as Williams steps in to take the face off. Skating through, and he gets by. Fritz comes forward, oh, and a good back check by Hodson saves the, saves the breakaway. Great play by Hodson as he tips that one up and over the net. Wenatchee now at the puck, into the neutral zone. Beliveau with the puck, skates it into the, into the Wenatchee and gives it to Williams. Williams sends it across and it's taken by West Coast. And we're gonna have another breakaway possibility, but a good play by Williams comes in on the back check and stops that one. Seven seconds left in the power play for the Wolves. Back to five on five hockey as the puck's buried up against the board. Out with it comes West Coast. And they're gonna skate all the way to the other end for Wenatchee. West Coast in their own end, moves it to the neutral zone. Skating forward. Now off the right board and into the Wenatchee end. Measle there to pick it up. He gives it up towards Ball. Ball's gonna give it to Kathy. And back to Ball. Ball skates down on the left corner. Now behind the net, in a battle. Out with it comes Wenatchee, right in front of the net. Popped up and tapped down and sent out at the board on the backhand and comes into the neutral zone. Lindbergh's giving chase. He's got Measle to help him out. As Kathy steps in behind the net. Good four check by West Coast. Battle into the corner, now behind the net again, Measle with the puck. As Wenatchee's able to get it into the neutral zone, long pass towards Kathy, Kathy steps it in, looks across, puts it in the slot, back to Kathy in the left corner. And puck's gonna be moved into the neutral zone by West Coast. Two on one for West Coast, shots taken right into the midsection of Bovey. And he'll draw the whistle with 13.55 left in the third period.
Puck goes back into the right corner, carried there by Fritz. Now Alonzo to Foss, Foss steps up. Foss with the shot, probably wouldn't have gone in, but regardless, West Coast goalie steps in and puts the glove on it and draws the whistle. 13.40 to go in the third period. Shuckman now on the faceoff, comes back out on the left board to Foss, who takes the shot, deflected off the stick and to the right side. Forsberg there, battling, puck dribbles into the, into the neutral zone. Foss, or excuse me, Oaks, Forsberg's gonna pick it up, goes back over to Alonzo, Alonzo dumps it in on the left. Now behind the net, over to the right side. West Coast first players to get there, held in on the blue line, shot taken and deflected off to the right. Behind the net, battle in front, and good opportunity as Forsberg takes the shot. Tries to get it in the five hole on the goalie for West Coast. And he shuts that one down and draws the whistle. 13-10 to play in the third period. Markham in on the faceoff. Flynn and Childers on the wings. Todston and Measle as the faceoff goes into the corner. Childers holds it in there. Dumps it back towards Markham. Markham skates forward, trying to find an opening. Steps up, circle, shot taken, wide left. Childers holds it in, sends it back to the defense. Measles there. Measles with the shot, deflected off to the left. Fort, uh, Markham's going to get it and drops it to Hodson. Hodson sends a shot wide right. Measles going to have to chase. He can't quite get there. Markham chases all the way back down. In behind the Wenatchee net. Off the board. Hodson gets to it. A little pressure there on him as he puts it off the board towards Flynn. Goes into the neutral zone. Flynn on the floor check with Markham. Comes to mid-ice, passes touched by West Coast and into the Wenatchee in. Wenatchee able to send it back towards West Coast. Now they're going to skate behind their net as Flynn's on the forecheck. Foss puts it towards mid-ice there to get its Williams. Williams skates up looking for Alonzo, finds him on the left side. Back behind the West Coast net, deflected up into the netting and we'll draw a whistle as the puck goes out of play. 12 minutes left in this contest for regulation. And Williams is gonna step in and be ready for the faceoff. Goes back to Wenatchee. Dumped in behind the net. Lonzo's there, but West Coast is going to come up with the puck. Good play. As it goes off the skate of a West Coast player and back into the corner. Williams on the pressure. West Coast trying to get it out again. Taken in the neutral zone by Alonzo. Gives it up to Foss. Foss steps back. As he's tripped up, no, no call on the play. Puck behind the net, West Coast in possession. Four check on by Wenatchee as Puck is lifted into the neutral zone. Bovey puts the hand up, calls for the icing and he'll get the call with 11.13 left to play in the third period. Ball steps up, puck taken by West Coast. Now stolen by, uh, by Hennessy. Measle has it for a second, loses control, has to step into the neutral zone. Retreating back is Fritz. Sends it up towards Kathy. Kathy's gonna cross the line. He's got Hennessy on the left side. Hennessy with the shot wide left. Into the circle is Kathy. He's got some moves going on there as he sends the puck back to his defense, stopped in front of the net. But a good back check by Ball keeps the puck in the Wenatchee end. Play comes forward. Kathy with it, sends it all the way over to Measle. Measle steps up, shot taken wide left. 
Stopped by Kathy, back into the right corner. Picked up on the blue line by Fritz, sends it towards Measle, can't quite make the connection. Measle steps up in the neutral zone and puts it back to Kathy. Kathy sending it in deep as the defense goes for a change for Wenatchee. West Coast moving forward. Out in front. Stopped by Bovey, goes over to the left side in the corner. West Coast is going to come out with it. Battle up against the board players going down on the ice as West Coast comes out of the, out of the battle with the puck. Backhanded shot wide right. Picked up by West Coast, sent in behind the net. And Wenatchee's going to carry it into the neutral zone. Taken by West Coast. Now again off the board, back in the neutral zone. Slid into Wenatchee's end, no call. Four icing probably touched where I couldn't see it. As Foss trying to find Alonzo, sends it a little too far, and Wenatchee will draw the icing with 9.15 left in the third period. Chuckman in on the face-off, comes down, goes back in the right corner, picked up by Wenatchee, Foss was there, can't get it past the D, but then it trickles by as Forsberg's gonna give chase and he's gonna try to get to it. Forsberg at the circle and deflected on a good play by West Coast into the netting. Forsberg had an opportunity, I think he had Alonzo on the right side, but couldn't quite make the pass get through the West Coast defense. Face off goes over to the right side, picked up by West Coast. Backhanded shots wide right into the right corner. Comes out on the right board when Atchie's going to get it. That's Shuckman. Shuckman trying to get it through towards Alonso and does. Alonso skating on the right side, trying to find an opening. Pucks dropped back. West Coast gets it. They send it in the neutral zone. Foss is going to be there. Foss gets it. Good play to Measle, and Measle carries it in. Measle with a move onto the circle, drops it towards Shuckman. One timer is turned away by West Coast and a good play by West Coast is gonna send it back towards the blue line and into the neutral zone. Fritzy looking for some help. Finally skates his way out of some trouble and lifts the puck up and all the way back into the West Coast end for the icing, 8-12 to play in the third period. Faceoff goes to West Coast. Childers trying to get it out of the zone. Can't quite make it. Good play by Wenatchee. Comes back with a puck into the neutral zone. Flynn giving chase. As West Coast puts it back in to behind the net. Dropped over to Markham. Markham drops it back towards Lindbergh. Lindbergh skates into the neutral zone. Lindbergh carries it into the West Coast end. Sends a shot behind the net. Childers gets to it on the right side. Sends it back towards the corner. Flynn's gonna pick it up. Back towards Childers, nice play. Can't quite get it towards the net and it goes to the left side. West Coast picks it up. Good play again, this time by Markham. Keeps it in. And Markham, Flynn, Childers line is doing a good job on the forecheck, but so is the rest of the Wenatchee Wolves. Let's call that so are the rest of the Wenatchee Wolves as I get my grammar correct as went. West Coast is trying to get it back into the Wenatchee in. Alonzo with the puck. Gets it into the neutral zone. Slapped right back into Wenatchee in by West Coast. Seven minutes to play. As the shot goes off the post, Bobby reaches down with the glove and covers for the whistle. 6.57 now in the third period. Three to two is the score in favor of the West Coast Renegades.
Williams on the faceoff comes back out to the neutral zone. On the chase is Beliveau. He's going to get there and cause some disruption. Good play by Beliveau to give the make sure make it so Williams can get to the puck. Shot taken, deflected off to the left. Stepping up is Measle. He keeps it in. Comes out off the board. Now over to the right side. Foss is there. Now Williams in the battle. He's going to come up with it in the right corner. Sends a good pass out towards Beliveau, but can't quite make the connection. Puck trickles back towards Bovey. Bovey steps up, gives it to Measle. Measle. Long pass towards Belleville. Belleville's in the, in the West Coast end. Shot taken, deflected over to the right side. It's going to go into the neutral zone. Trying to get to it was Flint, or excuse me, was Ball, but he couldn't quite make the connect, or get to it in time before it hit the neutral zone. And a long pass, I believe, or might have been a shot, goes from just behind the mid ice all the way to the board behind the West Coast net. And Wenatchee will have the icing. 6.06 to play in the third period. Ball's face off goes to the left board. Picked up by West Coast, stopped out in front. Second shot deflected off to the left by Bovey. Puck down, down on the red line. Out in front, Bovey comes in and they push one in past Bovey's skate. On the right post and to score their fourth game of fourth goal of the game with 550 left to play in the third. After the West Coast goal, puck goes back to Fritz. Fritz lifts it towards West Coast goalie. He puts a blocker on it and it goes back into the neutral zone. Picking it up is Lindbergh. Lindbergh gives it over to Fritz. Fritz steps up in the neutral zone towards Forsberg. Returned into the neutral zone. And now back into Win Winachi's in. There to grab it's Fritz. Fritz aims towards Shuckman and Shuckman knocks it down, skates it up, and gives it back to West Coast. West Coast sends it deep into the Wenatchee end. There to get it again is Fritz. Comes out, long pass behind Forsberg, but he's able to pick it up without losing much speed, and comes in on the left side. Great play as Forsberg sends it back to Shuckman. Shuckman one-times it from the top of the circle. Markham with the faceoff. 509 to play in the third period. Referee waves off Markham. Flynn goes in to take it, goes out to Markham. Markham sends it back to Hodston. Hodston with the shot bounced off a leg pad. And Measel will have to get there. Measel sends it to Markham. Markham retreats, gets to Childers. Childers over to Flynn. Flynn steps across the line, moves. Behind Childers goes the pass, and Markham gets to it. Markham turns around, he's got Childers behind the net. And out in front, and Flynn can't get to it in time. Second shot goes by Measle. Good play, and a battle in the net. Comes out, Hodson's gonna hold it on the blue line. Steps up, and he takes a shot. And we'll have a whistle as Markham was in contact with West Coast in front of the net and draws the whistle. We'll, looks like we'll just have a face off right circle. As they were in the crease where the contact occurred and both were laying on the ground. Face off to Markham, goes back in behind the net. Flynn's there, gets it out in front. Foss tries to get it, it goes off a West Coast player. 
And in the neutral zone, Fritz is there. He retreats, 422 to play in the third period, touched by Markham and sent in deep. West Coast sends it in behind the net. Bovey's there to settle it. Picked up by Fritz. And long pass sent towards Markham. Markham steps over. And he's going to go off on the change as West Coast goes in behind their own net. Belvo there on the forecheck. Now going to come in is Alonzo. Good play by Alonzo. As he comes up with the contact and puts the player down. Shot taken by Foss off the stick of the West Coast goalie and into the netting. 344 left in the third period. When we resume play, we'll have a face-off in the left circle. 3.44 to play, 4-2 to two is the score in favor of West Coast. Wenatchee sends it towards Alonzo, and then it's picked up by West Coast. Dumped in deep. That has a nice pass by Alonso in front, and it goes in! Pass towards Belvo. Belvo can't get it. And then coming to finish it off is Williams from the high slot right up into the upper right-hand corner to reduce this deficit to one goal, 4-3. to three. With 3.23 left in the third period. So score that one. Alonso, Belvo, and Williams with the goal to get the third score for Wenatchee in this contest. After the goal, ball's gonna come in for the faceoff. Puck comes out towards West Coast, sent back deep, giving chases Lindbergh. Gonna go all the way back into the corner for the icing and we'll go to the West Coast end for another faceoff. Ball will take the face off again. Hennessy and Kathy on his line, on his wings. Goes to the left side. Hennessy's there to get it. Turns around, left circle. Poke check by West Coast, sends the puck out into the neutral zone. Skated forward, now dumped. And now it's gonna go to the right side. Long pass towards Ball. Ball carries it in. Poke checked away, but there to pick it up is Hennessy. Hennessy skates forward, loses it to the neutral zone. He didn't have any defensive help. He was looking for someone to dump it to, and there was no one there as they were on a change. Fritz now with it. Mid-ice carries it into the West Coast end. He's going to go to the slot. Shot taken, deflected off to the right. West Coast sends it all the way back down. Wenatchee in, and they'll have the icing. 2.22 to play. Third period, four to three is the score when actually trailing by one goal in this contest against the West Coast Renegades. Puck comes out, West Coast takes it. They're gonna skate it into the neutral zone. Jumps past mid ice. And and he's gonna call a trip on the, probably the weakest call I've seen today. As Fritz was going for the puck and the player made the move and then tripped over him. I guess by the technical definition of tripping, that's, that's a penalty, but with the way the rest of this game's been called so far, I don't know if you can make that call. 2.11 to play in the game as Wenatchee is now gonna go down by a player for the majority of the rest of this contest. Markham steps up, gets the puck, goes back to Foss. Foss puts it off the board and into the neutral zone. Wenatchee's giving chase. Looks like they're getting ready to pull Bovey, but not quite yet, as Childers is waiting to come out of the box. 
off the skate of Markham, goes back to Flynn. Flynn's gonna send it to the defense. Pushed up forward off the board, and Markham's on the run. Flynn's there, and a big hit by Flynn right behind the board, and he's getting held up. Hey, you gotta call that! Sorry, as there is a huge interference on Flynn up against the board. And the referee turns a blind eye. After the weak call that got us here, I don't know if he can turn that one away, but he does. Childers there in the corner. As the puck goes in. Williams now with it. Childers with the puck. It's on the West Coast now going to come out with it, skating towards the neutral zone. One minute left to play. That's a big hit by Measel. Gets the puck back. Foss now has it. Skates forward. Sends it over to the right side. And Flynn's there. Taken in the neutral zone. 45 seconds to play. Measel now with it. Skates it into the zone. Sends it across on a good play. Can't make the connection is Flynn as Alonzo steps up. And open net goal at 32.2 seconds is going to make this a 5-3 game. So, Thirty-two seconds left in this contest. Five to three is the score. As Markham steps in for the faceoff. Goes back to West Coast. Off the board towards Lindbergh. Picked up there by Kathy. Kathy skates it in. Puck goes down, 10 seconds to play, and icing will be the call. Eight point five seconds to play in this contest as we go into the West Coast end for the faceoff. Timeout by Wenatchee with 8.5 seconds to play. And Wenatchee steps back and brings out six players. They're going to go with no goalie for this last eight and a half seconds. Puck comes off, comes out towards Foss. Foss keeps it in, sends it to Measle. Measle takes a shot. Deflected out to the right and off the board, and that's the end of the game. So the final score of this will be 5-3 to three in favor of West Coast. We'll be back in about five hours for the third game of this three-game series here in Provo, Utah, as the Wenatchee Wolves are taking on the West Coast Renegades. So far, the series is 1-1 one -one with the third game going to be the decider.
as we'll be back in a few hours to see who's going to come out ahead in this series.